are great. I need to see you go all the way to the finals. You are funny and electric and a star before you even open your mouth. When you walk out here, we love you. There's electricity. You are a star, buddy, and your life, and I know this, I've talked to you backstage, your life isn't what it was, and this show, I'm so happy to be a witness to what's happening with you. You're amazing. Thank you. All right, guys, what's up? We're here with Preacher Lawson. How you doing? What up, bro? From America's Got Talent, if you haven't seen it, go check him out. Uh, he's all over YouTube. Super hilarious. Probably my favorite comedian, honestly. Oh, thanks, That's being man. honest. That's like That's serious. crazy. That means yeah. you don't know any comedians. <laughs> I'm fit. <laughs> yeah, but definitely. Uh, so basically, uh, the people on YouTube know how this works. I'm going to do a trick, and I'm going to teach you uh, kind of how it's done. Okay. Um, but first, we actually have some questions since we have such a... So oh, you're doing, you're doing the trick, and then you're going to tell... Well, I'm going to do not... a trick, and I'm going to teach you kind of like a more basic version of the trick. So basically, we're going to start off with a few questions, just so, to, so you guys get to know them a little bit. Uh, right, first one's from, uh, from actually from Instagram. I asked you guys to give me some questions, and uh, this was pretty much a lot of few people asked the same question. Uh, just, just how was your experience on AGT? Like, what, what was that like? Blessed. <laughs> I mean, it was like, uh, it was, you know, obviously life changing, but it was just fun to be around that many, you know, all those people that, and the, uh, those people, uh, that many people excited about their lives being changed. And, you know, Simon, all the judges, Howard and Dale. Uh, I mean, the producers. Yeah, Mel B. Yeah, everyone was just super, it was a great person. It was, it was a great uh, environment. And I just had fun. I just remember I, I kept being in the moment. I kept saying to myself, hey, relax, be here. You know, because a lot of times you're, you're too focused, you know, on on, uh, on winning, you know, right. or like doing good and you forget to have fun. So I made sure I had fun. That's definitely great. important, yeah. I yeah, feel man. that. Um, yeah, also, um, do you have a favorite uh, magician that's been on the show, either with you while you were there? Uh, or My favorite magician is Matt Price. Matt Price. Yeah. Matt Price. Can you tell everyone Matt who he Price. is? Matt shout Price. Him out, give him a shout out. Shout out to Matt Price. Uh, he's a he's a uh, magician from Florida. He's insane. He's incredible. He's All like, right. Yeah. He just uh, he won. He was like second place in like the best magician in Florida or something like that. I don't oh, know. He's cool. not really he's not really like famous. That's cool. Famous, but All right, cool. You know, he's on TikTok though. TikTok. Hey, man. Right, I'm, not I'm on also TikTok. on TikTok. I just started going on there, so follow me. <laughs> you on can TikTok. plug yourself. Yeah, yeah man. Um, I got 11 followers. Who wants to be 12? Huh? <laughs> well, that? maybe you got like three more now. So that's... oh snap, yeah, 12 yeah. plus. Okay, so 11 or 14. I know the ad. I know the ad. <laughs> that's one of my talents, by the way, adding. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, I become like a mathematician or something. Yeah. Like, if comedy doesn't work out, you know. Yeah. I mean, it worked out already, but yeah. whatever. Um, so he's your favorite magician. Um, who was on the Who was a magician on the show when you were there? Do you remember like who? Uh, this was two years ago. What was it? It was two years, two years ago. ago. So, I mean, well, for, you were on Champions too. So Shinlin was on that. Shinlin was on Champions. He he's one. dirty. He's he's great. He's I mean. What do you say? Like he's dirty. Like he's so good that it's like dirty. Oh, okay, you know. I've never heard that man. That, well, now you man is that a new thing? You got a new term now. I, I don't think like, it's you, that new. Because no, okay, I think well you you just made that up because dirty means like no not like yeah, dirty yeah. like he's like not a good person. No no no. no. So he's I was like I was I, like yo he's gonna be no you can't be trashing somebody on my <laughs> interview like what are you doing? <laughs> I don't know him personally but Shin Lim, he dirty man. Like he's in the disgusting world, in the man. world of magicians he's I'm talking about stupid. I love him. Like whoa what did you just said three bad things. Yeah, he's great, man. Yeah, he his yeah his magic's incredible, and like um, yeah, I think he just got married too, so I think. That's oh, did he? Yeah, I think so. Oh yeah. man, that's great, yeah, man. Yeah, I think in Hawaii even I don't even know. All right, that's well. great, man. Um, all right, last question. Who's married me? Yeah, last question is what like it, like com there's comedians and magicians, but sometimes there's an overlap. So like, do you, I think, do you I personally think, think that's a good thing, a bad thing? I think it's a great thing. I mean, I feel like I feel like there's comedians and then there's magicians that are funny. Right. I don't think there's a I don't think there's a comedian that does magic. Okay. You know what I mean? But there's right. magicians that do comedy. Right. So, but they're not comedians. Okay. So I think there's comedians and funny magicians. I think that's. I don't think there's too much of an overlap. Right. I know. I, I, that, I think there's a huge separation. I can think of one person in my head who actually has a full career in comedy and a full career in magic, which is Ooh. pretty dope. Harrison Greenbaum. Yeah, I don't know who that is. So he's he's a New York guy. I mean, he was on America's Got Talent. I think also like. He just got through the audition, and I think he got on the second round. But I think he's a magician, man. Yeah, but I, but on America's I tell you, he went straight comedy, and he was on Last Comic Standing. So oh, like, was he? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, well, I'm stupid. So, and I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't know. And he didn't do any magic, just stand up. So, wow, that's he does crazy. a lot of clubs here. Like he he'll, he makes his rounds. So see, I'm yeah, that's that's my ignorance. Yeah, well, get to know. Him. He's anyway, a cool shout guy. out to cool Harrison. Guy. Was Harrison? Yeah, Harrison. Yeah, good yeah. On, yeah. Um, all right, so that's the questions. Thank you for answering those. Uh, 
Now we do a trick. We do a trick. We do a dope trick, actually. Uh, there's a couple components to this trick. The first thing is just this envelope. All right. I want you to tell everyone, since you're right here and they're not, uh, what do you what do you see inside there, honestly? What I see inside there? Yeah. Could be nothing. Like it's not just empty. Nothing. I'll show you guys as well. Literally just an empty envelope, uh, and I'll show you guys one more time. And I didn't just put anything inside right now. Just not. Right, cool. Good. Yeah. No. All right. Here's what I'm gonna do, nothing in my hand, short sleeves. I'm gonna seal this up, all right? So people think there's something under the flap too. No, it's just like the sticky stuff. I'm gonna seal this up like this. Boom, boom, you can just hang on to that. All right, so that's for you to make sure I don't, you know, do anything crazy. All right, uh, I got also here, uh, I have a book and a playing card. Now the reason I'm using a playing card for this uh, is because a lot of magicians when they do this trick, they'll cheat and they'll tell you to say stop and they don't stop when you say stop, they stop when they wanna stop. All right, so I'm gonna use the playing card as a bookmark so I can't switch the page. Does that make sense? Yeah, okay. cool, all right. I'm gonna do this, you say stop whenever you like. Stop. Right there. Is that really where you said stop? Yeah. I can move it if you want, because here's the thing, after the trick, uh, you're gonna tell me, yo, that was the coolest trick I ever saw in my life, but you didn't give me a chance to change it. So I'm giving you one shot right now. You can change it to a different page. Change. You're changing? Yep. All right, cool, where do you wanna go? Forwards, backwards? Forwards. Right here? Yep. Say stop here, say stop again one more time. Yeah. Right here? Nope. nope. Stop. Before the end. Right, okay, cool. Off. Right there? Right there? Yep, and guess cool what? Again? I'm changing it again. Oh, let's do it again. Yeah. Go for it. You make this hard for me. Up. Make this hard for me. And right there. Alright. Fair? Yeah. 100%. You want to change one more time or you're happy? Nah, man. Alright, cool. Let's change one more time. Yeah? <laughs> you can do whatever you want. I don't care. Uh, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to look away. I'm going to open uh, the book to the page. I want you to memorize the first word on the page. There's like a big bold word in every corner. It's like a dictionary. So in the corner there's one word. And then there's a there's a page number as well. It's somewhere towards the middle of the page. I want you to memorize both. So the word and the number, page number. All right, cool. All right, so first word on the page, you see it? Yeah. You got one page number inside? You see it? Yeah. All right, cool. Just memorize that. Uh, bookmark, we don't need this anymore. Uh, here, hold the book. Uh, think of uh, think of the word. I'm trying to read your mind. Think of it. Don't think of the last letter, think of a letter towards the end of the word. You got one? I'm gonna say it's maybe an E. It is an E. That's cool. Alright, cool. First letter. It's a K. K. Hmm. I. T T E N is the word kitten. Yeah. There it is. That's the word. Now think of the page number. Alright, but this time I want you to think of both digits at the same time. So you got it? Yeah. Here's the thing. I said think of both digits at the same time. He said, yep, that means there's two digits. You're making this easy. You're making this super easy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> page, <laughs> page 94. Yep. Is that it? There yeah. you go, page 94. Uh, and you can like kind of flip through, make sure there's, the words aren't like all the same on the page. Though. No, man, I like, trust you, bro. It's a dictionary. So right? here's what I'll do. I'm not really a mentalist. I'm more of a magician. And uh, I'm going to turn this into a magic trick. All right, cool. Cool. You have a good imagination. You tell jokes. You yeah. got to come up with all these different types of jokes. So uh, in your head, I want you to just uh, imagine you're taking the page and you're just tearing it out of the book. Okay. Done. Did it. Fold it in half. Yeah. Hand it to me. Alright. Invisible page. Yeah. I'm gonna throw it. How's invisible? I see it. I mean, it's right there. That's a problem. You should probably get help. I don't know. You see it? Probably get help because I'm a freaking Marvel character. Right, okay. that's true. <laughs> I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna throw it off the floor. Off that wall back there. It's still invisible. I don't know why you're looking. Off there. It's invisible to you. You can man. still see it. Alright. I, cool, I can cool. see it. That's because you don't got superpowers, bro. Doesn't mean, you know what I mean? Gotta put it in the same category. Um, I'm gonna throw it off there, off there, into your pocket. Oh, my pocket? Yeah. Oh, dope, man. But it doesn't stop there. It keeps traveling, obviously. I'm not that oh, it's not. Yeah, okay. And it goes actually into the envelope. Okay, cool. Hold up. Before we do anything, I'll just take this. Can you open up the page? What was it? 94? Seven. Okay. I, I think, yeah. I could, what was it? I don't remember. It was 97 or something like that. What was 97? 94? Uh, oh, joke is on 92. Hold up. Oh, okay. Okay. Keep, what happened? <laughs> okay, show, that's pretty. Can you show them? Yeah, man. Like, there's actually one page torn out of the book. Nothing in my hands. That's pretty legit. Previously, empty envelope. One page of a book. Yeah, hey, that's legit. There you go. Let's see if that matches up. Hey. Oh. Let's see if that matches. Don't match that up. <laughs> There it is. Perfect match, guys. Uh, that's dope. That's dope. There that's you go. Dope. Good stuff, man. That's the trick. Preach Lawson, guys.
Are you serious? What? And a lot of professionals use this, so this is like a pretty cool method. Okay. Uh, basically, I'll just do it and then I'll teach it to you. Um, say stop whenever you want. Stop. Right here. Give me a favor. Uh, look. Yeah, maybe top left corner. Is there a word there on top? Top. Left like right here. Right corner. Yeah. Yeah. There, yeah. yeah, for you. Yeah. Is there a word there? Yeah. All right. I'm not gonna look. Hold the book. Okay. Think of the word. Yeah. Starts with an S. Yeah. S A. Sapphire. Is that yeah. a word? That is a word. All right. So I'm actually gonna teach you how to do that. It's pretty cool. Where you can yeah, pretty read someone's mind. It's, it's pretty. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and it makes it like basically, obviously, most of it's acting, and most of it, uh, I already know the word. Um, but the question is how. So I'll show you. Uh, basically, when I do this and ask you to say stop. The sec, by the way, when you teach someone magic, it's always stupid. It's dumb, and you're like, you kick yourself. But that's every trick. No, I get it. I used to. I, <laughs> I was trying to be a magician before I started. Oh no way! Yes, yeah, so I, I know, know a few magic tricks. Ah, that's that's cool. why I was like, okay, I'm, let's see how this works. That's cool. <laughs> that's cool. I didn't know that. Ah, yeah, I know, but I know a bunch of card tricks. But oh, I nice. I have cards. It shows. Okay, I'll show you. Yeah. Card All right. So uh, basically, just the way this works is you do this. And I'll t you say stop whenever you want, right? Say stop. stop. Let's say you said stop here. Now, if you think about it, look from my angle. I can see that word. When I riffle through, I can see the top word on every left page, right? Like up there. And I can see oh, as I'm it. riffling through. And I'll show the camera this as well. Check this out. When you riffle through, you can see every word on the top left corner. All right? Now, all I do is this. I say, say stop whenever you want. You say stop here, let's say. I'm looking right now at the word platform, but all I do is I the second I see it, I look away and I just open the book full. So and then I tell you here, look at the word over there, which is the word I just saw technically, and that would be the same word platform in this case. Um, but the key here is that you want to look away, you want to just glance the word, you want to make it look like you were looking that way the entire time. So when they think about it in their head, they're just saying, oh, he, there's no way he knew he was looking away the whole time. So you just say say stop, and you could even when you start doing this, you could even be looking away. Say stop. Let's say you said stop here. I'll just quickly glance it and then open it and show it to you. So that's, that's pretty easy, it's dumb, but yeah. it's super easy and uh, yeah, and that's that's the trick, guys. Fresh deck, fresh deck. I know. Okay. Oh, see, I'm so good at this. All right. So I'm sure you already know this trick. I'm rusty. Let you know now. All right. Ready, bro? Yeah, go for it. Pick any card. Any card. Don't let me see it. Right. Any card that you hold on. Any card that you want. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm going to shuffle it again because I don't want to play. Yeah, maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe. You know what I'm saying? All right. Here we go. All right. Pick any card. Don't let me see it. Show it to the camera. You got it? Yep. All right. Put it at the bottom. Right here? Hold on. Like this. Put it in the deck. Right there? Anywhere you want to. All you right. sure you want it right here? Oh, yeah. I think that's good. Are you sure? Positive. I'm gonna shuffle it. All right. All right. Is this a card? What? No way. How'd you do that? <laughs> That's, guys, multi-talented comedian and magician. All right, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I'm sure you should go. I'm serious, I'm serious, I'm serious. Oh, you play ball. You should play ball there. There's dope courts out there, by the way. Is it? Like, you see that blue awning right there? I play it sometimes, like, randomly. So but I was looking for it. I was looking for the hoops. Yeah, so that blue awning, under there, there's courts. Oh, I'm going to go hoop it there. There's so, legit, so like, like All right. great courts there. Pick some. All right, show it, to the, show it to the camera. Don't let me see it. Got it. Put it at the bottom. Take as many as you want off the top. All right. As many as you want up top, you're going to put it at the bottom. Legit? Yeah. So, his car is in there, right? Yeah. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm about to find his car right now. No. Is that your car for real? No, actually wasn't it. Oh, okay. Hold on, I'm just playing, I'm just playing. <laughs> Don't tell me your car, because I know. Nope. He's, one leads to your car? No. Because that's your car. No. Are you messing with me? Nope. None of these are your car? No. Are you messing with me? I feel like you're trying to ruin my trick. None no. of these are your cards? No. Okay. Is he cheating? <laughs> okay, check this out. Tap two cards. Just tap them. These two right here. Oh, that's not a tap, that's a touch. Right. Okay, <laughs> okay, move those out the way. 
Tap two more cards. Move them out the way. Tap two more cards. Move them out the way. Tap two more cards. Tap one out of those two cards. Move that away because the other one's your card. This one? Yeah. No oh. way! There it is, guys. That's on, actually it. That was really good. Come on, play. Hey, hey, he thought I was sorry. That's what he thought. <laughs> Linda, get the camera. Right here. There you go, man. There you go, my bad. That was dope. That was really good. That was legit. That was actually not bad. <laughs> he was like, this is sucks, man. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's one of my favorite trips. I got a few. Hey, what's up, y'all? So it's Preacher Laws. Follow me on social media, on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, YouTube, all that. Now, what are you? What are you going? What's going on with you right now? What do you got? Uh, yeah, man. I just got a YouTube channel, man. We're you know filming some stuff, and it's not out yet. I uh, got a bunch of pilots that you never heard of. Uh, <laughs> we got um, got, got a, a special, got a special coming out. Got a tour oh, called, called Get to Know Me. I'll be in Vegas uh, this weekend. When are you putting this out? Uh, this is gonna go out probably couple days so yeah I'll be in Vegas you know I'll be in I'm doing a tour in Florida a theater tour in Florida so oh, nice. if you want to you know, come see your boy you got a special coming out that's pretty yeah cool. I do got a special coming out I don't know where it's at though so we'll see what happens but it's supposed to come out in the next few months that's cool that's but good stuff I'm excited about that and he hosted we forgot you hosted that show world's most amazing dog on Facebook yeah uh preacher Lawson what a legend super nice guy for letting me come down here and film this with him um we're out here Brooklyn Bridge Park you can see the Statue of Liberty you can see literally. Oh, I didn't even realize scene. you can see the statue. Really. Well, there it is. It's right there. And uh, yeah, guys, that's a long statue of liberty camera shot. I don't know. Uh, but here we are, Pizza Lawson. Thank you so much for helping out. You